the secondary turbos had it. Intake temperatures are ridiculous. Blow off valve sounds silly. It's engine bay makeover time. To get things started, we remove all the old and worn parts. Next up, we need to uh, decipher and decode the rat's nest and uh, sort out these vacuum hoses. The secondary injectors are increased from 850 to 1700 cc's. To fit them in, I just made a new fuel rail. The fuel pump has also been changed to an aeromotive stealth in tank pump. To fit the new turbocharger and wastegate, we have made a stainless steel exhaust manifold and oil drains. Before the final fit, parts of the manifold and the surrounding area are wrapped in a high temperature protective barrier. The .96 AR turbine housing has a stainless steel heat shield wrapped around it to contain the heat as much as possible. Pressure control is taken care of with a 60mm wastegate and a Blitz dual solenoid boost controller. To and from the intercooler has been finished in 3 inch stainless steel tubing. The air separation tank is one of my custom alloy ones. The new downpipe has the wastegate plumbed back in. So the setup is Garrett Turbo, k and air filter, HKS wastegate, truss blower valve, G-ready intake elbow, HKS twin spark, power FC, data logger, apex intercooler, and a lithium battery. <laughs>